So on the way to Toastmasters meeting tonight, 7 p.m. kickoff. It's all about enschleuning the art of slowing down. Take it easy. As you can see, I'm going very slow with my big toe and my crutch. Good to have a crutch in life when you lose your crutch. You're crutchless. Although that might make some people laugh. Now, this is a serious business. Toastmasters, Tuesday evening, August 7 p.m. 2022. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. And slowing It's the art of slowing down. Have you ever sat, watched a snail slip slowly across the sidewalk? Have you ever laid on your back and watched the clouds drift slowly by? Have you ever sat, watched the rain pitter patter slowly on the ground? If you've ever done any of these things, you've experienced Entschleunigung the art of slowing down. It's such an important concept, and in English, we don't have one word for it. Decelerate, slow down, take it easy, maybe chill. But Entschleunigung is so good taking the speed out of what you're doing. The Buddhists call this mindfulness, being totally present, totally here. Normally, our minds are very busy. We're sitting here, but we're home baking bread. We're on the U-Bahn last night. We're in a meeting. You're here, but you're not here. And if you know that, you're with somebody, they're listening to you, but they're not really present. Maybe they've even got their fingers on their device under the table. <laughs> and in this day and age, we find ourselves going faster and faster and furious. We've got laptops and mobiles and smartphones, devices. We're multitasking. We can't just do one thing. It has to be three or four. You ever feel like you're going to hell in a handbasket? Yes, we all do it. We're rushing to meetings, appointments, on the U-Bahn, and we're do -do 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 your brain's spinning, and you go, ah, stop the world, I want to get off. <laughs> well, you could just breathe. Put your hand on your tummy. Let's try doing it now. Ah. <laughs> you might even laugh. Ah. When I work in the kindergarten, I get the kids to take their finger, put their finger on their belly button. Now, grown-ups have problems with belly buttons. <laughs> but if you could really touch your belly button, <laughs> you might even giggle or tickle. And you can come down. You can calm down. You're no longer rushing and racing and running to get somewhere. You have Entschleunigung, the art of slowing down. Now, I got this foot, <laughs> this big toe, two weeks ago, before I knew I was going to give this speech. And when you have a prop in a speech, it really sticks. So with this big foot, I can do Entschleunigung. <laughs> I can slow down. The crutch came 10 years ago when I got a new hip. And also then I learned about Entschleunigung, the art of slowing down. Today, I forgot the other crutch. I was in a rush to get here. <laughs> so I'm only a man with one crutch. So I can do Entschleunigung, slowing down. And all of you too, you can do Meditation. Um, but if you've got kids, you probably can't do it for long. There's a noise. <laughs> but find a quiet space where you can sit. In between meetings, you can just sit quietly and just put your hand on the tummy and just breathe. You can come down. You can hold the silence. You could even have a piece of chocolate if you want. It doesn't matter. You can put it in your mouth, let it melt slowly. We don't eat snails in this country, but the chocolate can slowly melt in your mouth. Whatever you're doing, washing the dishes, making the tea, changing the nappies, working on your latest project, you can stop for a moment, put down the pen and just breathe. Whenever I give a speech, I want to say so much, I'm cramming to get too much in. John, John, slow down. Don't say so much. Just keep to the point and slow down. It's not just about pronouncing each word 
very slowly. It's about a concept where you live your life from the inside out, not allowing the world to dictate you with emails, SMSs, films, movies, this constant noise, but from the inside to find the peace of God. And from that place, you radiate peace wherever you go. You don't say much, you listen a lot. You're quick to listen, slow to speak. At Toastmasters, of course, it's all about speaking. But if you say too much, and you go on and on and on and on, blah, 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 you wear people out, their ears are burning. <laughs> That's why we have a timer. And when the timer shows the green, I know it's time to come to an end. We can all do it, but we don't do it because we're so busy in our heads. But if you can remember the crutch, remember the big foot, you too can practice Entschleunigung, the art of slowing down, down, down.